What's going on guys, my name is Epic Soren, and we are back with episode, oh I think this is episode 8 of Pocket Planes. We are in Havana at the moment, and it has been like 2 months almost, like almost to the day since the last episode of Pocket Planes. And I apologize for that, I did intend to play more, it just kind of slipped my mind, because every single other game I do right now, I play on my desktop, which is a Windows computer, and is thus not compatible with Pocket Planes. Or, Pocket Planes is not compatible with it. So, um, right now I'm just going to go ahead and get all our planes up in the air, and then we're going to look around and see what... who there's a box. We're going to take that. Oh no, there's two! Three minutes. Do we have anyone else in Guatemala? Or, nope. Dang it. That means... You will have to take both of those. Oh, well, they're at least they're in the same general direction. That's not too bad, then. Okay. Let's see. San Jose, San Jose. Alrighty. I think we're going to be doing okay, then. Okay, so the next plane lands in three minutes. Uh, grab that coin. 6,500 coins. Um... Yeah, 83 days ago was the last time I was logged in here. They allow you to carry on candles in Havana? Sweet! Uh, yeah, I don't... I, I think that's a bad idea. Oh, right now, at least at the time of recording this, um, the global event is in Houston. I obviously don't have enough money for Houston, but we could fly to Houston. It's just right there. And then my game on my phone, I have, uh, I think, all of these cities right here. So I'm trying to save up for Houston in both of those. And, oh, we fly to Santo Domingo, too? I suppose we could probably close some of our airports to buy Houston. How much does Houston cost? 30000 so we need 24000 more coins. So if... for Example, we say, close Santo Domingo, how much do we get? 9,780. Okay, that's not enough. Uh, maybe I will try and record two episodes tonight. That way we can hopefully get some more of the global event, because two or three global events ago was for C-130 parts, but this one's just for bucks, right? Yeah. Um... Yeah, there you go. That's how long we haven't played. So long it doesn't even show up. Our average daily revenue is zero. Okay, um, do we... I guess the next thing to do would be check to see if we can't build anything. So in that case, we should check global market. Do we have a Wallaby M? We do. Okay, so all we need is Wallaby C, which there are no parts for. Okay, so we don't need anything in the market. So all we really have to do is wait till you land. Oh, 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 big coin. Gotta get that. Definitely gotta get that. Oh boy, I don't know what to do. I'll probably edit most of this out. What? Two big coins in a row. Now, a bucks? Maybe, please? Please? That's not a bucks, but I'll take it. New jobs. So we're going to have a lot in Guatemala in a minute. Let's see. We do have a Bucks job in Gua Guatemala right now. So we definitely want to get you on the ground so you can take that. Wait. Is that... Is there other jobs to Panama City? No. Oh, no. Four minutes. So he could... This guy could go to. This guy can go to San Jose when he lands, and this guy can take the bucks to Havana, uh, or where wherever it was to. I think we will do that because that way we're getting the most profitability out of our bigger planes, and our smaller planes can focus on getting those bucks delivered, like we want to do. So this guy needs to needs. Okay, there we go. I was gonna say he needs to land, but yeah, if I yeah. We can't do that, but we can do San Jose, right? Yep. So we'll send him back where he came from to San Jose. And 
You are going to land in one minute. Okay. Coin? Wow, I totally missed that. Okay, one, one, three, three, four. Already. Oh, most of them are doing Havana across thing. Oh, there we got a box for C1W2P delivering those, um, one of those two box passengers. So that's good. Um, so this is like bucks galore. That's awesome. Pfft, who needs the global event when I'm earning this many bucks? But then I mean like, who needs bucks when I have nothing to spend it on? Like, look at that. It's empty. No, go away. There, okay, whatever. Oh, no, no. Oh, I got it. I got it. I got it. Okay. Okay, let's, um, come on, land, please, faster. Land, you're making me nervous. Do all my pilots have pilot costumes on? Okay, they do. So we're gonna maintain that. And then what is my plane colors? We're doing the same colors for all the planes in this one, which is bright green, sky blue, and sun glow. And I really, really like those colors. On my phone, I've actually started... Um, most of my fleet is like... Well, I have only like... 10 or 12 planes, I think, total, including the ones in my hangar, but, um, most, most of them are all the same paint job, but a few of them are not. I would like to build up a fleet of not kangaroos, birch, birchcraft, there they are, and birchcrafts, uh, for the range, and the Maple Pro, these ones, for the class one, and also for the range. There we go. Now get you up Panama City, not Havana, opposite direction. That's going to be an eight minute flight, so we're not going to see that delivery in this episode, but we might in the next one if I keep recording long enough. But I've already been recording for at least five minutes, and I'm not quite sure how much more, so we'll see. Um, we still need to do the, we still need to know where to go from here to Houston. Um, at, at this point, I think we really should save up for one of the blue cities, because um, I, think, I think we should. So Bogota, Caracas, Miami, Houston. We could try for Mexico City, but Mexico City is really expensive, and, you know, if we go for... Uh, Miami is the cheapest one of those, which is only 28000 All the blue cities down around here are pretty expensive. Why is there a plane on the ground? Oh, right, because you can't take off yet because you're not full, and I only full fly. Uh, uh, bleh. I can't talk today. I only fly full planes. There we go. Okay. So, hmm. Wait. Oh, okay, yeah. I was going to say, normally the Wallabies make less, but they are making less, so I don't know what I was complaining about. Okay, who landed? You landed Panama City. Awesome! That's awesome! So many bucks! That's, like, weird. It's so awesome. Wait, did it, that is that the refresh jobs? No, that's really bad. Awesome! You can take off for Havana, and we can get... Oh. We can get some more bucks. Get up there. That's going to be another 8 minute flight. Oh boy. And you can't go anywhere. Well, why not? Is there really... They're all right. And... No? What? San Jose Airport did the exact same thing. Four passengers and no cargo. Huh. I mean... Okay, when is the market refresh? Oh, ah, that's not what I wanted. <laughs> okay. San Jose landed, okay. And you can't take off for anywhere either. We're going to load the Guatemala job because that's the most likely one that you'll be able to get. 
because Guatemala is the highest in-demand city. And I'm going to end off this episode right here. Um, yeah, so thank you guys very much for watching. I'm almost definitely going to go ahead and record the very next episode right now. So, yeah, thanks for watching. Love you guys. Peace. Bye.